Hey guys, Adam here with First Spear. Today I want to go over the overlap cummerbund and show how to quickly size and fit it to our Assaulter Armor Carrier or other flagship platforms like the Strand Hog. First thing you're going to want to do is take your plates or whatever armor package you're going to be running and insert them into the carrier. If you're going to be wearing a concealable uh, soft armor vest, make sure you have that on underneath your plate carrier when you do your cummerbund sizing. Now that we have our plates inside our vest, we're going to want to put it on the individual over the top of their concealable armor, if that's applicable, without the cummerbund. Now we're going to take our overlap cummerbund in two sections and attach it to the front panel of the vest. and we're gonna secure the cummerbund over the back face of the rear panel. What we're looking for here on a good fit is to have the side panel of the cummerbund line up perfectly with the back panel or even a little bit inside of the panel. What we don't wanna see here is elastic hanging out. If you have elastic hanging out, you're gonna get a ballistic window and have no armor protection there. Once we have our cummerbund properly sized, we're gonna simply remove the two tubes on the front, remove the cummerbund, and we're going to take the vest off the individual and insert the cummerbund through the rear channel and secure it down. Before you put your cummerbund through the rear channel, it's a little bit easier if you move the rear plate out of the vest. Now that we have our cummerbund through the vest, it's secured down. We're going to test fit it on our guy just to make sure everything's good to go. Everything's good and secured. We have no gapping here on the rear. Again, this is our overlap cummerbund. Check it out on the website.